Hey-o, good day everybody. Hello, hello. I hope I'm not too dark. I don't know why it just looks so dark in the viewfinder. I hope it's not piss-ass dark. Welcome back to the kitchen. Today we're going to try to make this. Old-fashioned glazed donuts. Okay? I wrote it down just now. I've never tried to make them before. I'm going to hope that we're all right. Um, man, that looks so dark. I don't understand. Maybe EV is off or something, but I've tried messing with that too in the daylight and stuff, and it didn't care. So anyway, we're going to try. I wrote this all down. Old-fashioned glazed donuts. You don't need to make sure you need a bowl. Two and a half cups of all-purpose flour. All right. That's quite a bit of donuts. So, half. One. Half. Two. And a half. Two and a half cups flour. Going to need that some more, so I'll set that aside. What else do I got here? One, one tablespoon of baking powder. There's a tablespoon of baking powder. Okay. One tablespoon of baking powder. Haboof. Wabam. All right. Got that. Uh, one quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon. That doesn't seem like very much, does it? I guess I'll measure it. <laughs> quarter of a teaspoon, eh? We'll splurge and give it just a little bit of extra. That's good. One quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon. And I'm calling one half of a teaspoon of nutmeg. That's like stuff that goes in pumpkin pie and stuff. Pumpkin pie and stuff. Well, I just happen to have some nutmeg. Half of a teaspoon. Half of a teaspoon of nutmeg. Okay. This isn't very powdery. <laughs> it's been sitting a while. We'll get her. Okay. There we go. Nutmeg. Nutmeg. It's all done there. All right. Uh. And then mix this together. This is our dry stuff. Okay, we'll just get a whisk. Whisk her up. M-A-G and the mama and squeak. Carl the dog and Blue the baby dairy cow dog are on their way to Illinois this morning to visit. They're racing a snowstorm. <laughs> That's going to be coming in southern Illinois. So, good luck to them. What do we got here? I got that. Now the wet ingredients. Okay. Let's we'll just put you over there. Um, I need four tablespoons of melted butter. I know that much. I do not have that. Ha 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 ha. Unsalted butter, baby. Four tablespoons. Melted unsalted butter. Let me get that real quick here. One, two, three, four. Right through the middle. Right there. Okay. Um, I guess I could just put it in a big bowl. Maybe. I don't know how much this wet ingredient is going to be. <laughs> how much is the wet ingredients? Buttermilk. One cup. Ooh. Yeah. You know what? I'll just melt this in here. We'll get another bigger bowl. We're going to need a bigger bowl. <laughs> uh, toss this in here. I'll get this melting up. Uh, just like so. Takes about a minute. Uh, get that melting. I want to get... Oh, where did I keep that now? I don't know where I keep it anymore. Um... Right here. It's right here. I want to get my wok out. <laughs> well, that's melting. Dust it out a little bit. I want to get about two and a half inches of oil in my wok here. Wok! Wok a wok! <laughs> Give me about two inches, two and a half inches of oil, right, y'all? Fry up a couple at a time, you know what I mean. About like that. I'm going to kick this on. 
Not on high, that's for damn sure. I'm going to go to about 5.5, and we'll see what that temperature. I want 350. There's the microwave. There it is, Bob, the microwave. All right, here we go. We've got, got some melted butter. All right, let's get this toss in here for now. I want this little bowl like this. Now, one cup of buttermilk. I do not have buttermilk. I am just going to go with, get this over here. Uh, I'm just going to go with one cup of milk. I mean, you know, what the hell can I do? <laughs> I'm not going to do the old put some vinegar in it trick or anything like that. I'm just going to go with milk and see what happens if it comes out good. One cup of milk. Eh. One cup of milk in the bowl. All right. Put this over here. Hua. Milk it in the bowl. Shut that cabinet, Phil. Jeez, it's driving me nuts. Shut this cabinet. Okay. Uh, vanilla extract. Two and a half teaspoons. All right. I get close to that. Sheila says, mm hmm. One, two, and a half. Okay? Two and a half teaspoons of vanilla extract. Uh, this is weird. One third of a cup, okay, of sugar, granulated sugar. Try to break the clumps out of it. <laughs> Third of a cup. Uh, granulated sugar. Plus two tablespoons. Right? Third of a cup. Where is it? Third of a cup. Yeah, plus two tablespoons of sugar. Uh, a little more. Uh, okay, there's that. You go over there. Uh, and the melted butter, right here. All goes in cha, thusly. Okay, that goes in here. And we're gonna mix this all together real good. Like so, get it all whisked together. La, 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 la. <laughs> get it all mixed up here good. Whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. All right. Then we got one large egg, right? One large egg. I got a large egg right in here. Watch this hell. Watch the magic of this hell. Ugh. One large egg. Close this, bang, and we go, one large egg. Bingo, out of here you go. His fingers, wash fingers, don't want to get chicken eyes. <laughs> all right, we're good, yeah? Stir this all together real good. Whisk this up. Then we're gonna switch to a spatula. So that was pretty nice. And it go. Switch it to a spatula. Um, green spatula. That looks good. That looks good. Okay. And wool floured surface. That's not yet. Wet to the dry. So we're going to put the dry into a little volcano here. We'll put the wet in here with it. And this is going to make a sticky ass dough, it says. So I'm going to do that. We're just going to kind of fold it like biscuits or muffins. Don't want to overwork it. She said you'll get a you'll get a tough donut. I don't know. <laughs> I had my stand mixer out. I put it away. <laughs> so just start pushing this all together. Smush, smushity, smush. That'll make me a sticky dough, I suppose. La, la, la. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right.
Yeah, it's 7.09 in the morning right now. <laughs> Getting an early start today. We got up at 5 so they could get ready to go and get the van loaded and stuff. <sighs> yeah, that's a very sticky dough, all right. Tablespoons of flour, but I'm not seeing that, baby. That's a lot sticky. That's not just a little bit sticky. <laughs> this is a mess. Oatmeal sticky. <laughs> so I'll mix this in. A little more flour. Like she said, I don't think that's going to do it though. Look at that. That's horrible sticky. She didn't adjust properly. This is going to take a lot more flour to get anywhere near <laughs> workable dough. Uh, right now this is a cake batter. <laughs> A loose bread batter. Mm. Eh. Keep mixing it around. That is horrible. <laughs> that is bad. More flour, BLG. More. See people lying. Not saying their real truth on their measurements and what they had to add. <laughs> That's what they're doing. I just added two more teaspoons or tablespoons. No, you didn't. <laughs> Bitch, you went haywire. I haven't found a, in a cookbook, believe it or not, I found a cook, uh, uh, a recipe for, um, what was it? I found a recipe for, um, cookies, uh, ginger, ginger snap, gingerbread cookies that called for like four cups of flour and it ended up being almost eight cups of flour before it was even usable. So lying people, they lie. More flour, BLG. That is horrible. It's too sticky still. <laughs> work this in. I think I might be able to work with this. It's got to be able to roll out. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, that is... Look at it. <laughs> look at that. Mm, that's horrible. I'm going to try to work it on the counter here. Well-floured surface. You got that. I am the king of well-floured surface. Righty can shake some flour all over the place, man. <laughs> He's good at it. Look at him go. Well-floured. You're damn skippy well-floured. Get flour everywhere. Damn skippy, I will. <laughs> mm -hmm. King of well-floured surfaces. Just like so. And I am going to try to get this out of the bowl. <laughs> I am not believing what this chick is talking about. Look at that. It's sticking to the bowl so bad. Yeah. <laughs> get out of there on the counter, please. Will you? <laughs> Can you? Oh, I don't have to drive the motorhome to the store. Squeak left me her car so I can drive to the store. They're only going to be gone a week, but I'm going to have to go to the store twice. You know, get beer and what have you. Alright, this is going to suck for a little bit. This is going to be bad. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, my God. Yeah, get this off. Okay, um, um. Oh, boy. <laughs> Flower the down. Flower the top, she says, and works them in. And whatever have you, and pat it out into little circles, and yeah, mm -hmm. there was the ice maker, make an ice baby, make an ice, let's fold this in a little bit, <laughs> that is really, really sticky, there ain't no donut cutter going to make a donut that lets go of this, now it might, uh, work it over here, <laughs> I'm trying to get it work up, workable here. Mm, there we go. Okay. Light dust. Light dust. That might work. So this is going to make like 12 donuts. Or more. We're going to find out. <laughs> that should do. Hopefully. Um, rolling pin. Roll it out, she says, to about a half inch. But one third to a half inch thick. All right. She said it's not going to be perfect. Um, look at that. Mine just happened to be perfect. I don't know about you, but thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Then we cut donuts. 
All right. <laughs> um, how do I want to do this? I have a catcher here for donuts. Just to have, have a donut catcher. But I need a donut pan. Here, we'll put them on. No, that's not big enough. I don't think. We'll get a pan. <laughs> okay, now. I have donuts. I happen to have a donut maker, right chalk. Hua, donut cutter. Cut donuts. Put them in the pan. Oh, that's really sticky. But it's a donut. Poke out the little hole. I'll just put the little holes over here. Donut. Oh, that one broke. Okay. So they're too fucking sticky. <laughs> donut, hole, donut, donut, donut hole. We'll just redo that something. I don't know. Donut. <laughs> Doesn't want to let go of anything. There's a donut. Okay. Donut hole. Poke him out over here. Donut. Right. Toss that sticky ass mess over here. Nope, that's stuck to the counter. No, wait, that came up. I don't know how that did that, but it came up. <laughs> well flowered surface, my ass. Donut, please. Okay. Let go. Donut, okay, donut hole. That one did all right. Donut, if you don't mind. That one did all right. Doing a hole. Hey, baby. I'm getting there. She didn't mean well flowered surface. She meant flower the shit out of that countertop. <laughs> Everything wants to stay to it. Here we go. This one worked. Donut? Anyone? Donut hole. Uh, donut? <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Donut hole. Uh, we'll call that a donut. <laughs> Close enough. Nine. Donut hole. Okay, then I gotta gob all this together. Ooh, God. Nasty. <laughs> Nasty, sticky mess. Um, spread more flour out. For sure, do that. Work this together. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Re roll it out to about a half inch, I'm going for. About a half inch thick. Like that. Donut! <laughs> Clip a donut. Zip zap it bop. Try to get a fucking donut. That oil smells like it's getting too hot. Let me check that right quick. It might not be, but I'm gonna check it. I'm gonna cut around 350. Yeah, turn it down. We'll turn it down some. It's climbing right past 350. Okay. Um, one more time. Hit me again. Donut. <laughs> uh, that's a little better. Donut hole. Mess. Donut. This little extra bit of dough here. I'm not going to mess with it. I'm just going to make what it makes here. And that's going to be what I made. Donut. Donut hole. And uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Good enough. I'm throwing this out. I don't give a shit. Good enough. I'm throwing this away. Don't care. It's out of here. Okay? Moving on to the more fun stuff. <laughs> Said this camera likes to look way down or way up. It doesn't really have a middle. We'll try that. 
Yeah, that looks good. Okay, shut off. I want something to flip set donuts. Do I want to use a knife? Maybe I'll use a knife. Actually, I think, I thought, I had, where did I put that? I could have swore I had, here we go. Got one long skewer right here that I'm gonna use to flip donuts. <laughs> I hope. A nice dark golden brown. Let me see what I got here. Can I turn that that way? Thank you. See what the temperature of my oil is again. Four hundred. Shit. Turn it down, BLG. Four hundred. 423. God dang it. <laughs> I'm just going to have to wait for it to cool off, I suppose. 380, 390, 407. It's still climbing over 400. I'm going to let that cool off for a while, I guess. And uh, we'll have to go from there. <laughs> okay. Alright, but well, I guess we're just going to go for it. <laughs> we're gonna go for it. I know it's hot, but we're gonna try cook us a donut. Here we go. It's in there. <laughs> it's very sticky, and it's in there. Put another one in. You put two at a time, maybe. Two at a time, baby. Going for a nice goldeny brown. All right. Nice dark goldeny brown. We're gonna try it. I could put another one in there, but I'm not gonna crowd the pan. I'm gonna do two at a time. Two at a time, two at a time. Well, I'll tell you what, that smells fantastic. That's gonna hit that oil. It was like, damn, I'm gonna turn that fan on low. A little bit darker, I guess. See, once a dark golden brown. The oil's still at like 404 degrees, but. I'll call that golden brown. Fuck, I don't know. Probably want it a little darker. Turn them back over. Turn them back over. I'm going to let them go a little more. I'll let them get nice and dark like the picture showed. And I'll put them on this rack right here to drain and stuff. That one right there. That, that rack right there. And we'll see if this freaking picture comes out dark or not. I don't know why it would. It's it's bright in here, <laughs> but it's like looking really dark in the viewfinder. Flip that one over. Yeah, there we go. Give those just a bit. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I can wash my thermometer while I'm at it, you know. My thermometer, not your thermometer. Mine. <laughs> I don't know what I did with the lid. To my thermometer. <laughs> there we go. My thermometer. <laughs> in you go. La 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 la. Looking good. Looking good, baby. Then they come out. When all the all these dozen here get over here on the rack to just drain, then we're gonna make glaze. <laughs> I suppose that's what it said. Glaze out of powdered sugar. This stuff right off. And some vanilla extract, I think, and a little bit of water. I haven't cleaned up my mess on the counter yet. No, I haven't. Not yet. Ow! Out you come, bitch. Doing it. Smells fantastic. Old fashioned glazed donut. Don't burn yourself, BLG. Watch what you're doing with that stick. Doing it. There's two. Let's see if I can get any more of these off of here nice and easy like. There's one there. Oh, that one's stretching. Get him in there, BLG. That one's going to be a weird shape. Poke it round again. There you go. That'll do. <laughs> That's the thing about them. They stretch. Okay. Um, okay. We're still going, right? Coolness, man. Coolness, man. All right. A little more dark golden brown, if you're asking me. I'm going to turn that heat up to... About 2.6 now. I think our oil is cooled down. 
So I'm gonna kick the heat up just a little bit. We don't want greasy donuts. No, 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 no. Well, I'm gonna fry the rest of these up. I tell you what, I'm gonna fry these up in the holes and we'll be right back. We'll take a little breather. God, that's dark. I don't know why that looks so dark. Mmm, Sheila says. Hey, look at this. I'm all white and stuff. It's me, Lefty. Um, BLG figured out the camera. Set this bitch in snow mode. S-N-O-W. Snow. It has incandescent. It has fluorescent. It has snorkeling. It has sun, clouds, um, and all kinds of different shit. I put it in snow mode and everything just came like, BAM! Yes! I'm back! Okay, no more dark. So, what we got here is we're going to make our glaze for the donuts. So we use about a teaspoon vanilla extract, about like that. And, put that up here. I'm going to move this off of the burner. Thank you very much. Moving to walk off of the burner. Okay, now, um, get my whisk out again. And I'm just going to use about a quarter of a cup of water. And you put some and you stir. And you put some and you stir. Apparently, so you get a nice thick glaze for the donies. That's, um, I bet it's looking like she might have lied to me again. There's the whole damn quarter of a cup. Two and a half cups of powdered sugar, she said. So let's do the, oh man, she might, she might have got this one right. And you whisk it till you get a smooth glaze. A nice thick glaze. That looks like what she made right there. While your donies are still kind of hot. We're going to dip them in this glaze. Get these off of me. Like so. And we're going to take our donies. Still nice and warm. I'm going to put this over here. Try to get these little guys out of the way. We're dipping in here. Flip them around. Get them all coated up real good in the glaze. You can see, right? Get them all coated up in this glaze while they're nice and warm. Take them out. Uh, back on the rack. Just like that. Next donut goes in. Glaze. Nice and glazed. Nice and glazed up. Uh, very nice. Like so. Turn them off. Back on the rack. Bam, baby. And just keep going through all your donuts. Get them all glazed. Then they go back on the rack to cool off the rest of the way and to actually dry so the glaze can set on the donut, you see? Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I'm glad I figured out why the camera was so dark and how to fix that. I'm really beginning to like this camera for what it is. <laughs> it does not. I watched my, four, my 4K video this morning. It's not 4K. And that's what the review said. This thing doesn't even do 4K. It says it's 4K, but it's not 4K. It's correct. <laughs> it looks like a poor 1080. So, I set it back, I think I set it back this morning to 1080, or we're in 4K again. I forget. I think I put it back in 1080, though, this morning. I'll have to look and see real quick here. Get donuts glazed, baby. Take them off of the rack here. Get them out of the way so we got room. I need room to work up in here. They look like giant fucking onion rings. See this darker donuts? These darker ones? That's what they're actually supposed to look like. The darker donuts, they're supposed to look like that. But, you know, <laughs> I finally got my oil towards the end. I got my oil all situated up, what have you, and it was working just fine. Turns out a wok with two and a half inches of oil or three inches of oil in it works great. For frying donuts. Walk in a chopstick. And I did these little donut holes here. I did them with a spider. Fished them out with a spider. Uh, it's like a little... Uh, it's like a little uh, wire cup on a stick. <laughs> you know, spider. Set this on here. On the rack you go, baby. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Flip them. 
I'm not going to do the donut holes. I'm just going to leave them plain. Thank you very much. It's just my choice. Yeah, baby. I know you can't really see them right now, but I can. See, they're supposed to look more like that. Nice, dark, kind of dark brown. There's two of them on here. I'll show you. They're a perfect. They came out perfect. And they're the last two that I did. <laughs> She wasn't shitting. Two and a half cups of powdered sugar is about what it's going to take to glaze up. I got three to go. Okay. All right. Oh, these are going to be good for BLG for the next few days. These are my get up at night. Nighttime snacks. Get up and pee, lose a beer, take a nibble off of a donut, go back to bed, baby. It's going to be good. Don't it be good? Look at that. Look at that, folks. I'll show you in just a second. Uh. If you like the video, take the time just a little second and uh, maybe click on that subscribe button for me down there. Maybe uh, hit the like button if you don't mind. Ring the notification bell if you'd like. It lets you know my future videos when they're coming out. Yep. Yeah, I'm rolling the donut on the stick. <laughs> Isn't that a game where they played with like a hoop on a, and a stick back in the day? Before YouTube and and Sega Genesis and all that shit? Nintendo? <laughs> Here's a hoop and a stick. Have a blast, kid. God, hours were spent. Hours were spent smacking that hoop around with a stick. <laughs> all right. There they are, there they are, baby. Sheila, get out from under me, please. Thank you. Fix my fingers so I can get a grip on things and take yourselves a look at this, people. Have yourselves a good look at this. Oh, yeah. I think you're going to dig it. Let's get down here where you can get down there. <laughs> I'm shrinking you up. Have yourselves a look at that, would you? Holy smokes. These two here, that's what they're supposed to turn out. Nice and dark brown. But I'm happy with that. These look more like the Tim Hortons you get in Canada. They're kind of the same thing, but these are glazed. These would be more like a Tim Hortons donut right there. And i got to let all these set to tell you if they're any good or not. I'm going to guess. I'm going to try a donut hole. Um... Uh, I'm very sad to say they're delicious. You can't have any. I'm going to have to get rid of these for you. Me and Lefty and BLG. And Sheila and Dingo get one too. They get one of those little balls. <laughs> Indeed. So, like I said, thanks for sticking by and watching the video. If you like it, take time. Hit the little like button. Hit that subscribe. Till the next video, folks, for Hands On with BLG. I am BLG. I am Lefty. <laughs> And I am Righty. <laughs> and uh, you guys know what to do until next time. That's right. Peace out, people. Just peace out. <clears throat> Hands on with BLG. You never know what you will see. Oh, yes, sir. Hands on with BLG. <laughs> Stick around and learn from me.